in your marriage with blowing apart. So keep the trust and keep the truth flowing. Speak a word to the right, which suggests speak words that are kind. Don't speak harsh to each other. Don't speak nasty to each other. But speak words that are gentle, kind, and considerate. Always speak to the right. Whoever obeys God and his messenger has already achieved a mighty success. It is natural for a man to expect his wife to respect him, to look up to him, and to obey him. And it is natural for the mother, the wife, to expect the children to obey him. It's called the natural order of things. But this will never happen until the two of you respect the chief authority, and that is God. And when the man obeys God, the woman naturally obeys him, not thinking that she's obeying him. She is seeing herself as one who's obeying God, and the children will fall right in line. So we have to put God first and always in our life. And as long as we keep him first, everything else will take care of. So we trust and obey God, and we believe in Him, and never love each other to the point that you forget the one who gave you to each other. My brother, you should love your wife, but don't forget the one who gave you your wife. You should love your husband, but don't love him to the point that you forget the one who gave you your husband. So don't make God two or three. Keep him in his proper place. Keep him. Number one. Oh, you who believe, be careful of your duty to God with the care that is due to him. And do not die unless you are submitted to God. So our commitment to God is not just for today. It's for tomorrow. And it is forever. And if we keep that strike, our, our relationship with God, if we keep that tight, then our relationship will stay tight. But if your relationship with God is not tight, in every other relationship that you have will be loose. So if you want a tight marriage, make sure you tight with your Lord. In Islam, it is tradition that a dollar will be given. From the man to the woman, the bride to be. And this dollar has been given and accepted. And I'm a witness to that fact. If the man has small means, he gives something to represent his means. To represent his dignity that he is somebody. So the diary is given as a form of respect and dignity for the man. I also have discussed with Brother Bilal and have also witnessed the contract, the greatest of all contracts, is between a man and a woman. And at this time, I would like for the father to stand. Brother Zed, the father of the brother, is giving his daughter hand in this sacred union. Marriage is beautiful, but it becomes more beautiful when the parents approve. And so it is good to know that the father has approved. Thank you. The two of you, you look very beautiful sitting there. And I don't like to say this, but I have to say this. You must stand. This is a strong position, standing. If you don't stand for something, you'll fall for anything. So we ask you to stand on what you're about to say, which are your sacred vows. And these vows will be taken three times by the each of you. First by you, Bilal. I, Bilal Sabir, I, Bilal Sabir, sincerely and solemnly agree, sincerely and solemnly agree, to marry Sada Al Khali. To marry Sada Al Khali. Of Columbia, South Carolina. Of Columbia, South Carolina. In accordance with the Islamic law. In accordance with the Islamic law. And the law of the United States of America. In the law of the United States of America. In the presence of two witnesses. In the presence of two witnesses. And many others. And many others. And many others. I promise to be a faithful husband. I promise to be a faithful husband. I, Bilal Sabir, I, Bilal Sabir, 
Sincerely and solemnly agree. Sincerely and solemnly agree. To marry Sada Alcala. To marry Sada Alcala. Of Columbia, South Carolina. Of Columbia, South Carolina. In accordance with the Islamic law. In accordance with the Islamic law. And the law of the United States of America. And the law of the United States of America. In the presence of two witnesses. Presence of two witnesses and many others. And many others. I promise to be a faithful husband. I promise to be a faithful husband. I believe to be. I to be. Sincerely and solemnly agree. Sincerely and solemnly agree. To marry Sada Alcali. To marry Sada Alcali. Of Columbia, South Carolina. Of Columbia, South Carolina. In accordance with the Islamic law. In accordance with the Islamic law. And the law of the United States and of America. Law of the United States of America. In the presence of two witnesses. In the presence of two witnesses. And many others. And many others. I promise to be a faithful husband. I promise to be a faithful husband. <laughs> I Sada Al Kali. I Sada Al Kali. Sincerely and solemnly agree. Sincerely and solemnly agree. To marry Bilal Sadiq. To marry Bilal Sadiq. Of Greenboro, South Carolina. Of Greenboro, South Carolina. North Carolina. <laughs> North Carolina. In accordance with the Islamic law. In accordance with the Islamic law. And the law of the United States of America. And the law of the United States of America. In the presence of two witnesses. In the presence of two witnesses. And many others. And many others. I promise to be his faithful wife. I promise to be his faithful wife. I saw the outcome. I saw the outcome. Sincerely and solemnly agree. To marry the last of you. To marry the last of you. Of Greenboro, North Carolina. Of Greenboro, North Carolina. In accordance with the Islamic law. In according with the Islamic law. And the law of the United States of America. And the law of the United States of America. In the presence of two witnesses. In the presence of two witnesses. And many others. And many others. I promise to be his faithful wife. I promise to be his faithful wife. For the third and final time. That was the time to run. You had a chance to run. And if you say something three times, we know you weren't drunk. We know you conscious of what you're saying. Very conscious. I saw the alcohol. I saw the alcohol. Sincerely and solemnly agree. Sincerely and solemnly agree. To marry the last of you. To marry the last of you. Of Greenboro, North Carolina. Of Greenboro, North Carolina. In accordance with the Islamic law. And the law of the United States of America. And the law of the United States of America. In the presence of two witnesses. In the presence of two witnesses. And many others. And many others. I promise to be this faithful wife. I promise to be this faithful wife. At this time, let me present the witness.
Make dua, make supplication, and wish.